Good News By Aaron Perkins I was only eight years old, and I had been going to Sunday school for a couple of years. I had always accepted that there was a God, and there was a place called heaven and a place called hell, but I don't remember thinking much about how to arrive at the former or avoid the latter. I knew I was a sinner because I had an awful temper, even at that age, and I had let it get the better of me a few times. When I started third grade, our pastor's wife had a good news club two days a week after school. This only ran for the months of September and October. Since there was little for the neighborhood kids to do after school, we went there. Besides, if we went to all the meetings, we would get a Bible as a prize. About halfway through the club meetings, I realized from the verses being taught that because I was a sinner, I needed a Savior in order to get to heaven. The pastor's wife said that Jesus was God's Son, and that He had died on the cross to take the punishment for our sins. Although an invitation was given to talk and pray with her after club was over, I was too shy to come forward. But, as soon as I got home, I decided to pray. I told God that I knew I had sinned against Him, and I was sorry. I said that I knew that Jesus died on the cross for me, and I asked Him to save me. From that moment on, I knew that I was saved and on my way to heaven no matter what. My bad temper didn't instantly disappear the moment God saved me, but as I matured as a Christian, it gradually dissolved over time. The biggest difference I felt in my life right away was the security in knowing that God had been gracious enough to save my sinful soul, and I was His forever.